In case you didn't watch Monday's video, make sure to watch that first. But in short, I made an arboreal enclosure with a unique design that enables you to see into the tarantula's hide and also it gives you uh, easy access to the hide. So now I'm going to transfer my Pezzoteria Metallica but first I am on the floor because I want to get her out on the open and try to get some nice close-up shots. Since I got this new camera I wasn't really able to record her properly so I want to get her out and show her glory. Now hopefully she won't freak out and this will be a bit a bit tricky because let me just show you because she has a really nice hide that is really cozy so I'm not able to even watch her for a long period of time fortunately here on top I have the I have this wooden piece that I can remove so that way I was able to periodically check her out to see if she's okay but other than that since I got her she was like I saw her like five or six times outside and that's it that is kind of the main reason why I even started thinking about the enclosure that is like this one that I made that provides a really nice natural height so Torrential will be happy satisfied or whatever so Torrential will feel secured and also in the same time it will enable you to actually see your tarantula when you want, need or whatever. I will try to coax her outside but I'm pretty sure that won't be as easy. Catch cups but I'm on the floor so she has a lot of space to move around. Okay let's see how she will react. Just as I thought. It's really hard to show you, but thread posture. ASAP. You can't really blame her. I am invading her house. But anyway, I will try to push her. Okay. She's coming outside. Oh my. This is a rare sight, rare sight indeed, to see her outside. And she's pretty fat too. Too bad I haven't been able to find her a mate. Oh, strike. I, I think that I won't even try to get her really outside because these are some nice shots. No need to stress her more than it's needed. Hello darkness, my old friend. Let's see how will we do this. Not satisfied. Not satisfied at all. I don't like when tarantulas ball. And I also hate when they stand their ground because then you really don't know what they will do. It's easy when you see that they are slowly moving whenever you touch them, but when they are standing, that is kind of scary situation. She's really not having it. I have this sketch cup, but it is really not. I worry that it is not wide enough. And I don't have bigger. Okay. And where is my. I don't have a lid.
she has the opening on top. How can I guide her here? like this <laughs> I don't like how she is catching it really not cool See, she really remembers that her hole is there. Maybe I should put this on this side. Let's try it like that. Now just so you know, she is really bright on this video. I mean her blue is really bright and intense, but it is only under the bright light. So if you ever get Pezzoteria Metallica and if it doesn't have as much blue as on this recording, know that you need the bright light to actually see the blue colors. From back, she's not that bright, but from front, man, so nice. I like how she's just sitting there. Look how she is quick to find the hole. Immediately she is going there. It's like she knows. Imagine this scenario, you were waiting one year to get Metallica, then you finally buy it, spend a lot of money on it, because they are expensive, you made a nice looking terrarium, it had a plant but it died off because reasons, but so yeah, you make nice terrarium, you get the Metallica, you put it inside and then you don't see it for the next six months. I mean really, but now if you have enclosure like this one, even if she is hidden, you can just There we go. There is your Metallica. Oh, I forgot. I forgot to measure her. But it doesn't matter. You can see that she has a lot of space inside. So really, space is not an issue. So yeah, let's close that off. And I also forgot to take pictures. Oh well, I will just take screenshots from the video. This was, I think, rather smooth transfer. I was really prepared for much worse scenarios, but it went pretty good. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, thumbs it up and comment something. And if you're new to this channel, make sure to subscribe. I upload every Monday and Friday, so see you again soon. Bye! -bye.